What's up guys and welcome to another transfer video on the channel and first of all I hope you guys have a good week and today on the news we're gonna talk about Van de Beek Manchester United want once again to sign the Ajax midfielder this summer and they want to beat Real Madrid for his signature also in the news we have Liverpool after they failed to sign Timo Werner from Leipzig they are now looking to sign and to seal the deal for Adama Traore from Wolverhampton and finally on the news we have Barcelona they are still still looking for a left back and Rafael Guerreiro is the next on their wish list the left back from Borussia Dortmund check all of these news and much more next in the video guys let's try to hit 400 likes in this video so smash that like button it's really really important for me and for the channel guys so don't forget to leave a like it only takes one second and let's start this guys enjoy Ok guys, today we start with Adama Traore is now at the top of Liverpool's transfer wishlist after losing out on Timo Werner to Chelsea, reports The Mirror. Wolverhampton could therefore face a double blow this summer with Mexican forward Raul Jimenez also tipped to leave the Wolverhampton. Celtic have started talks with Otsona Edward over a new contract, reports the daily record. The striker has been linked with Leicester City among other clubs, but the Scottish giants are confident they can keep him this summer. Inter are still hopeful of signing Arturo Vidal this summer according to Calcio Mercato. The Chilean has long been linked to a reunion with Antonio Conte, for whom he played during the pair's time at Juventus. Sandro Tonali is another top Nerazzurri target, with the Brescia youngster the subject of ongoing talks between the two clubs over a transfer. Lionel Messi and Marc-Andre Ter Stegen have started talks with Barcelona over extending their contracts, reports Mundo Deportivo. The Argentine's current deal is up in 2021, while the goalkeeper is under contract until the following summer. But Barcelona are keen to move quick to extend their stays, with Nelson Smedu and Ansu Fati also priorities for new deals. Barcelona's delay in completing a move for Lautaro Martinez could see the Catalans miss out on the forward altogether, claims Marca. The Argentine is also being watched closely by Real Madrid and Manchester United, who could both make a move if Barca continue to drag their feet in talks. Milan have turned their attention to Benfica prodigy Thomas Araujo according to Calcio Mercato. Araujo, 18 year old, is the captain of both Benfica and Portugal under 19 sides and enjoys a good reputation as a promising defender. Real Madrid could end the summer without a single new signing according to Marca. While the likes of Eduard Camavinga and Kai Havertz have been linked with the Bernabeu, with an already bloated first team squad, may choose to protect the balance sheet and abstain from the market. Manchester United and Chelsea are ready to go toe to toe in the transfer market for Fiorentina winger Federico Chiesa, as the Daily Mail reports. Juventus and Inter are also chasing the 22 year old, who could be available for around 50 million euros this summer. Chiesa has scored 7 goals in 26 games across all competitions for Fiorentina in 2019-2020 season. Manchester City defender Angelino has reportedly emerged as a shock target for Barcelona as they look to sign a new left back. The Spaniard returned to City in the summer but left just a few months later on loan to Leipzig where he has massively impressed. It is claimed by Mundo Deportivo that Barcelona have been watching Angelino and are considering a move. Manchester United are going to reunite their pursuit of Ajax midfielder Donny van de Beek this summer according to the Times. The Red Devils have long been credited with an interest in the 23 year old and have been tipped to beat Real Madrid to his signature this summer. Van de Beek contributed with 8 goals and 11 assists to Ajax's latest Eredivisie campaign before the season was cancelled due to the coronavirus in March. Amiens striker Girassi is wanted by Ligue inside Rennes as they chase Champions League football next season. After the recent Ligue 1 campaign was abandoned, Rennes have secured a spot in the preliminary round of the Champions League and are eager to reinforce their attack over the summer. According to reports, Girassi is firmly on Rennes' radar, with discussions between the player and the club ongoing. Tottenham have identified Wolverhampton midfielder Ruben Neves as a transfer target according to Luten Sport. José Mourinho is a keen admirer of the 23-year-old and would like to lure a fellow Portuguese to Spurs this summer. Neves is open to joining Tottenham despite the fact his current contract at Wolverhampton is not due to expire until 2023. Leo midfielder Bruno Guimarães is the subject of interest from Barcelona according to Don Ballon. Barca see the 22-year-old as the ideal long-term replacement for Sergio Busquets 
who is approaching the later stages of his career at 31 year old. Guimarães has featured in 5 games for Lyon since joining the club from Athletic Paranaense in January. Bournemouth have submitted an opening bid of 5.6 million euros for Porto midfielder Fabio Vieira according to the Sun. Cherry's boss, Eddie Ho, is eager to bring in the highly rated 20-year-old before his market value increases. Vieira has yet to earn his first senior appearances for Porto, but has been a star performer for their B team this season. Borussia Dortmund defender Rafael Guerreiro has emerged as a transfer target for Barcelona, as reported by a Portuguese newspaper. The Spanish champions are planning to include Junior Firpo in a summer deal for Inter striker Lautaro Martinez, which will leave a spot open at left back in Kike Setien's squad. Barca want Guerreiro to fill the role, despite the fact that the 26-year-old recently committed to a new contract at Dortmund, set to run through the 2023 season. West Ham teenager Jeremy Nguia has rejected the offer of a short-term deal to see out the remainder of the Premier League season, according to The Guardian. The 19-year-old fullback, whose current deal expires at the end of June, has already turned down the offer of a multi-year deal at the London Stadium. The Hammers had hoped to at least keep Nguia until the end of the campaign, but are now resigned to seeing their youngster leave on a free transfer. Tottenham have ended their interest in Italy midfielder Nicola Zaniolo after Rome valued him around 70 million euros, reports the star. The North London club have held a long-standing interest in the 20-year-old and even held talks over a possible swap deal involving Toby Alderweireld last summer, though they ultimately moved on to other targets. Spurs had explored the possibility of reviving their interest this summer, but feel Zaniolo is overpriced by its club and is subsequently out of their budget. Real Madrid have explored the possibility of signing midfielder Benasser from AC Milan according to Fichases.com. The 22-year-old who joined the Rossoneri from Empoli last summer is believed to have a 50 million euros release clause in his contract. Manchester City and Paris Saint-Germain have also been linked with the Algerian midfielder, with the latter believed to have already made a 30 million euro bid for his services. Juventus midfielder Pjanic has turned down offers from Manchester City and Paris Saint-Germain because he is determined to seal a move to Barcelona this summer, according to Marca. Barca are keen to sign the Croatia international, but talks between the two sides have so far yet to reach an agreement over a fee. Manchester City and PSG both look to take advantage of those tall discussions with offers of their own, but Pjanic has set his heart on a move to Camp Nou. Even Rakitic has attempted to quash speculation over his future by insisting he will stay at Barcelona next season. It has been suggested that the Blaugrana will cash in on the 31-year-old before he becomes a free agent in 2021, with Sevilla reportedly eager to resign their former talisman when the transfer market reopens. But Rakitic says he is going nowhere this summer, even though he is not happy being left out of the Blaugrana team. Paris Saint-Germain have made an improved offer worth 40 million euros for AC Milan star Ben Nasser. The French giants had an initial 30 million offer knocked back, but the Latin Sport claims they are ramping up their efforts before Real Madrid and Manchester City jump in. Fiorentina are considering a summer move for Ether Berlin forward Piatek, according to Calcio Mercato. Piatek only moved to Berlin in January, but has been linked with a move away after failing to start any of their matches since, since the Bundesliga resumed last month. That has attracted the interest of Fiorentina, who are looking to add experience to their attack, to support Patrick Cotrone and Duvan Vlaovic. Napoli expect Mertens to sign a new contract, but José Calderon could leave the club, according to sporting director Cristiano Giuntulli. Mertens has been linked with Chelsea and Inter as he approaches the final weeks of his deal, but it appears the 33-year-old is set to stay at the San Paolo. Rome are close to reaching an agreement with Manchester United to sign Chris Smalling on a permanent deal, according to Corriero de los Sport. The England defender has impressed while on loan in Serie A and Rome, are keen to extend his stay in the Italian capital beyond this summer. The club hoped to agree a deal to extend Smalling's loan to cover the 2020-2021 season, with the obligation to make the move permanent for around 15 million euros at the end of that campaign. Paris Saint-Germain have agreed terms with Milinkovic Savic, but are struggling to reach agreement with Lazio over a fee for the Serbian midfielder, according to Latin Sport. 
PSG sporting director Leonardo has made Milinkovic Savic one of his prime transfer targets this summer and is prepared to pay him around 7 million euros a year in wages. Negotiations with Lazio have proven much tougher, however, with the Italian side rejecting an offer of 60 million euros and demanding in excess of 80 million euros. Manchester City youth forward Charlie McNeil has agreed to join German side Leipzig according to Sports Illustrated. The 16-year-old had already announced on social media that he was leaving City after six years in the club's youth ranks. Juventus were also believed to be interested in signing the youngster, but it is Leipzig who have won the race for his signature. Valencia are plotting a bid for Monterrey centre-back Cesar Montes. Valencia cannot afford to match Monterrey's asking price of at least 8 million euros because of the financial hit they have taken amid the coronavirus pandemic. Mark claims the Spanish outfit will buy 50% of the 23-year-old rights for around 4 million euros to bring him to Spain, with the intention of purchasing the other half the following summer. Inter and Barcelona are struggling to come to an agreement over the valuation of Junior Firpo. Mundo Deportivo says the Catalan side have offered the fullback to the Italian outfit as part of a deal that will see Lautaro Martinez go the other way. Barca hope the inclusion of the 23-year-old will take 41 million euros off of the 111 million euros asking price for Lautaro, but Inter have a different figure in mind. And finally to win the video guys, Ethan Horvath will leave Belgian side club Bruges this summer, according to reports. The Belgian side will offload the United States international as well as fellow goalkeepers Hubert and Carlo Letica. We reached the end of the video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, you already know, let's try to hit 400 likes in this video like I said in the beginning, so smash that like button, destroy that like button, it only takes one second and it is really really important for me and for the channel guys. Also don't forget to leave a comment down below about the video, about rumors, about confirmations, about anything that you want me to answer you guys and subscribe if you're new, stay safe, I'm Default and I'll see you guys in the next video.